Hi guys, this is Derek Carnejo and welcome to my podcast. Before we begin today's episode, I want to put out an ad. I want to further my understanding of businesses. So if you're working in a business or you know someone who you think I'll benefit from meeting, please reach out. I would love to speak with you over the phone. Today's episode is on how I think about management and the people who run the company. This is not something we can measure with mathematical precision, but businesses are run by people and having the right people at the top can have a huge impact on the value of the business. The first thing I am looking for is integrity. I want the managers to be honest beyond a reasonable doubt. For me, a good track record or a rising stock price is not proof of integrity. People can get wealthy and enjoy long periods of success through trickery, intimidation, bullying, and dishonesty, but that always comes unraveled. So integrity is the first thing I look for. The second thing I look for is ability. If somebody has a lot of integrity, but they don't have business ability, then they can be a very good friend, but they are not someone I want to go into business with. Generally, I like founder-led businesses. I like CEOs who have been with the company for a long time, and I like people with lots of industry experience. If you're looking for great CEOs to study, here are a few of my favorites. Sam Walton of Walmart, Jim Senegal of Costco, Truett Cathy of Chick-fil-A, and Reed Hastings of Netflix. I am currently reading The Smartest Guys in the Room by Bethany McLean, which is about Enron. The company filed for bankruptcy in December 2001. I think executives should study Enron because it's the opposite of how a company should be run. The company promoted the wrong people, played accounting games, lied to investors, cheated customers, went into unrelated businesses, adopted compensation systems that incentivize bad behavior, and so much more. Let me know if, you're, if you have read any good business books lately. That's all for today. Subscribe if you enjoyed. Thank you so much for listening.